Welcome back to my final morning report analysis video on Thursday 1st of February with me, which is Market Analyst at Hattic Markets, looking at gold, which is still a bit of a consolidation, isn't it? But it's interesting that this pivot around 13.44 is sort of coming in as a basis of resistance in the last few days. There, You get sort of little pokes above it, but it just seems to be that the momentum is sort of coming out of this rally. The momentum indicators is rolling over the stochastics and MACD lines have sell signals. The RSI is sort of tracking now below 60. And again, um, sort of running lower highs on each of the last sort of four sessions, um, potential with another one today. So that resistance around 13.44 seems to be a pivot near term. Uh, you can see that on the hourly chart where the market just buzzes around there and just rolls over. You've got the momentum indicators on the hourly failing at 60 on the RSI, rolling over it's around neutral on the MACD line. So it sort of uh, all adds up towards pressure on the lows, uh, the recent lows. 1344, 1342, sorry, 1334, 1332, um, and a break below that would mean 1325, which is the next breakout support, old old resistance becomes a new support, 1324 area, 1325, and then below that you're looking at the pivots at 1300 to 1310, so um, this is an important uh, near-term sort of move by the market. If it sort of continues to fail under 13.44, you could easily see the market sort of correcting back 13.24, 13.10, 13.00. But um, holding up for now to an extent, I mean, y yesterday's positive bull candle will has, hel have, has helped sort of stabilise the bulls a little bit. But as I said, you've got this basically consolidation now, sort of between of about 10 bucks really, 10, 15 bucks. And a move uh, below that consolidation would certainly open up the uh, the next level of support. So I wish you good luck in your trading. Uh, I'm away for a few days, so uh, I will speak to you again next week. Thank you.